Hey guys, uh, Caleb here, your Saturday host. Um, for any of you that care, uh, I got a little update on my shoulder. Um, I don't know if I said last week, but it's sprained and I started physical therapy. Um, it still hurts. Physical therapy makes it hurt. <laughs> it's more swollen. It's not hurting it, I guess. And today, me and my parents are going to go look for cars, since mine was totaled. But enough of me. <laughs> this week's topic is uh, famous YouTubers. And um, I could only really think of three famous well, FTM YouTubers. Uh, I could only really think of three that I personally had watched. Um, I don't really watch them anymore because I used to just watch for um, transition stuff. Uh, it would just it would just give me hope, I guess. Um, I am really blinded by the snow outside. Holy crap! But um, yeah, I um, the first guy I've talked about several times. I'm sure um, Skyler. Everybody know well, not everybody, but a lot of people know who Skyler is because. He is still very, he is really active in the trans community, and I know that he still makes videos. Um, I actually follow him on my most recent YouTube, so um, I started watching him. I think uh, it was his second video he had posted. I found him <clears throat> second, like it was the second week of testosterone. Um, and I loved watching him to see all his changes and stuff, and it was great being able to see that because I'm pretty sure I'm the same age as him. So um, seeing somebody that was my age, and at the time I, I think I was only like 18, uh, see him go through that, and uh, you know, I remember him making a video that uh, his school used his preferred name before he had it legally changed at graduation, and I was, I was just blown away by that. Um, <clears throat> But yeah, I really liked watching him. He, you know, I th I'm not sure when I stopped watching his transition videos, but I think it was somewhere around um, just before his two year mark. Like I, I, I don't know why, I just stopped watching YouTube videos, but I did. Um, but yeah, he's still a really big part of the trans community, and he's actually a really great mu musician. Um, I've heard some of his stuff and it's really great. Uh, I even follow him on Tumblr now. Um, yeah, but uh, then the, the next guy uh, was a guy named Evan. Uh, he was from Canada. And I started watching him pretty. And yeah, you know, was saying about all the process and uh, all his feelings, and, you know, it, I think I started watching him because I had a lot of similar, similar feelings, and it was great uh, seeing him get to start testosterone and have top surgery. But since he was in Canada, the process was a little different, so uh, I wasn't really watching it for education. I just felt like a connection to him. Um, I think somewhere close to his one-year mark on testosterone, he took down all his pre-T videos because he didn't want to be seen like that anymore. Um, and then he started, I think he had started making less videos and I kind of stopped watching, but that guy, he was great. Um, I'm, I believe he had had a breast reduction before he, um, had a total mast mastectomy. Um, both of them, I'm fairly certain, uh, you know, that his government paid for because he lived in Canada. Uh, I remember one of his biggest things was afraid that his nipples were going to fall off. <laughs> But, um, yeah, I really liked watching his videos. He was cool. I don't remember his last name, unfortunately. Otherwise, I would totally look him up. Um, and the last guy, I, his name is Jace. Um, I don't know his last name either. He was great. I liked watching him because um, once he started testosterone, he started working out. And I thought it was really great to watch him gain muscle. Um, or, he had been working out, but... Once he started T, he started just, like, gaining crazy muscle. And I don't know why I stopped watching these videos of these guys. Um, it's weird that I stopped watching them, and now I'm thinking about them, because when I stopped watching them, it was like I'm at the same point of transition as they were when I stopped watching their videos. And I don't know if I just got bored, or 
I got caught up in the relationship I was in and I was just doing other things, but uh yeah, these guys, they're great guys. Um I'm going to have to try and find them and maybe I can see if I can find their YouTubes and see if they're active or something. I don't know. But yeah, those are some famous YouTubers I used to watch and they um I I watch them cuz they're really inspiring. So yeah, I I guess that's all I have to say about them. Um so maybe one day I'll be as famous as them. I'm not sure. Probably not, but whatever. They all just, you know, they're doing it. I, I feel like they want to keep track of their transi transition, but they also, you know, want to help people. So um, I hope that my videos can be as helpful as their videos were for me. So, But yeah, that's all for this week, and I will see you guys next week.